Hey guys, Sunday night, just got my Sunday night hike in, and I think like all people on a Sunday night, no one wants to cook, we just want to kind of get the week started without having a bunch of dishes and stuff, at least that's what my wife would say, and I listened to what my wife says if you saw my last video. But uh, to make things easy, I get done with my Sunday hike and I go to QFC to go get some lunch meat. I like QFC's lunch meat because they serve boar's head. I'm not normally a QFC guy. QFC's kind of the upscale grocery store in the Northwest here. I'm more of a Safeway guy, but I'll go there to get lunch meat. I just want to throw it out there because I'm not pompous and stuff. But as I go there, there's got to be 10 people around the deli counter all wanting lunch meat. Now, QFC doesn't have a number picker to, to take a number and say, okay, I'm number 17. Okay, I'll wait for my number to be called. Rather, it's a fucking mosh pit. Everyone's just like gathered around. So when you get there, you kind of have to do this survey. It's like, okay, all these people were in front of me, you know, and I'm just kind of making mental notes. I should be taking pictures and just deleting them as they go along. And then people start coming in behind me as I'm waiting. And, you know, you kind of like squeeze. It's like, no, I'm before you. Just kind of makes, you know, getting your, your turf set up and stuff so that people don't try to cut. I'll give them benefit of the doubt, unwillingly cut, but they will cut you if you if you give them an inch. So I finally get up there, and I want three meats. I want my roast beef, I want my turkey, I want my ham. I want the trifecta of cold cuts, right? But the problem is, is I've got ten people around me who are waiting in line. Now, if I know that if I go up and say, let me get some turkey, half pound of turkey, and they'll come back, and they'll cut the turkey, and they'll give it to me. Oh, and let me get a half pound of ham, and they'll go back. People behind me are going to get pissed. You know, and I don't mind pissing off people I know, but strangers, I mean, I don't want a stranger to judge me. No one wants a stranger to judge me. You know, I'd rather piss off someone I know than, some, than piss off a stranger. So what I like to do is I get up there, and I order all three at one shot. So I'm like, half pound of turkey, half pound of ham, half pound of roast beef. You got that? Great. Let's go. He starts slicing the meat. I go off and do the rest of my shopping. So as I'm doing my shopping, you know, I'm getting my bread. I'm getting some milk. Before I know it, I'm all the way in the ice cream line. And I'm like, oh, shit, the lunch meat. I got to go get that. So I'm, you know, moving through the store real fast. I'm kind of swinging people out of the way. And I get there. And there it is, it's the turkey and the ham, and I'm thinking, wait a second, it's been like 15 minutes. This guy hasn't had to have cut this um, in this amount of time. So, you know, I yell out, not, not in an aggressive manner, I'm just like, yo, 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 did you get the, the roast beef? He's like, oh yeah, and I'm like, well, it's not here. And he's like, oh, I don't know. And then all of a sudden it struck me. One of those fuckers behind me took my fucking roast beef. Are you kidding me? goddamn bunch of goddamn animals. And as I mentioned, this is QFC. In the Northwest, this is kind of the premier store. I mean, I would expect that shit at fucking Walmart. I mean, Walmart, you're going to order meat. If you say, I want some meat, you know, some method's going to pull out his cock and say $20. But this isn't supposed to happen here. Just goes to show, there are fucking animals everywhere. So he did cut me the roast beef when he got done with this other order, which pissed the people off behind me. But you know what? At this point, I'm upset. And they're part of the herd. Now, they might not have taken the roast beef, but they're part of the problem because they're part of that mob. You know, I wish the roast beef I ordered was like gluten-free or organic, something that really tastes like crap. So that person goes home and is like, ew, this is disgusting. Who would have ordered this? I should have said liverwurst and put a roast beef sticker on it. Yeah, that would have showed the motherfucker. Anyway, the next time I go to order my, my meat and I've got a situation like that, I'm not going to leave the place, but I am going to just kind of scoot around, you know, where the potato salad and the coleslaw is and just kind of keep an eye on things. This way, no one actually knows it's for me, so they're not getting pissed off. But at the same time, I'm kind of keeping track of my meat. And then when they get there, I'll just sweep in and just grab my meat. Not, not like grab my meat, you know. <sighs> wow, that didn't come out correctly. Um, again, that's probably the Walmart thing. Um, anyway, you guys have a good night. I hope your day goes a little bit better than mine. I do have all my meats now. I am ready to make some great sandwiches. Um, I hope you guys have a good dinner too. Bye-bye.